focus, but that's literally, it's, it's snowing. And I dread walking to class in this. Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you're new. If you are new here, my name is Molly. I'm currently a sophomore biomed slash pre-med major here at Moorhead State University. And if you just saw the clip that I filmed where I told you it was pouring the snow, I literally walked my 8 a.m. in that just for the door to be locked. And my professor doesn't have a key because of COVID. The rooms had to be switched. So we're like in a big auditorium type room. I walked up to the fourth floor just for class to be canceled and I had to turn around. My dog's super happy about it. I mean, I'm not gonna complain. She's just gonna record a lecture and put it online. But I woke up and went to the gym and <laughs> because I have a really busy day today and I'll explain more later. So it just sucks knowing I could have slept in a little bit and gotten some extra sleep, but you know, it's okay. Everything happens for a reason. So there is a positive in this somewhere. So I just finished eating breakfast. I decided to just fix like a bowl of oatmeal because it was quick. Also because it was warm and it's freezing in my apartment. Um, it's 8.30 right now. Typically I would be in class, but uh, obviously that's not the case today. So I think I'm going to start working on a study guide for my chemistry exam I have Friday. Um, I just wanna like, I don't know really, I don't know how to prepare for it. Cause I feel like the worst exam is always the worst to prepare for. Cause you don't know like the professor's style of exams, unless you've had them before. But comment down below how you prepare for your first exam um, of the semester. I figured I'd make a study guide, some flashcards, and then just fill that out, go over the flashcards of like vocab and different functional groups I need to uh, memorize. I'll show you kind of what we're doing in chem um, so you have a better understanding, but I think I'm going to do that and then watch a genetics video that I need to do before my genetics class at 11. And typically I would have been done for the day, but I have to do like a makeup lab practical so I have that um, at three o'clock and then I teach spin at six so busy day today. I apologize if you can hear Layla chewing on her toy that might be gross for some people but it's a little while later I have been working on some genetics notes and um, I pretty much got everything done on my study guide up to the point where we're out right now in lecture so I just have to wait on the notes from today's like lecture class to put that under my study guide. So right now it's 9 30 and I actually just got done writing my checks for this month's rent because it's February. That's so exciting that it's already month two of 2021. Uh, but right now I think I'm gonna go to Cash's just for a little bit. It's still pouring with snow but the roads aren't super bad. I like show you guys but i just figured i can do my 11 o'clock class there he called and he was like hey come over because he doesn't have classes wednesday wednesday friday so i figured why not i right, use an updated <laughs> look at the weather as you can tell it's snowed a lot more and all of that is still snow coming down but my campus has done a really good job on keeping the roads clear so good job moorhead <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just uh, lighting a candle to set the mood. But I think the last thing I told you all was that I was going to go over to Cash's and see him and do some homework and I think I got some footage of that. So it's currently one o'clock now and I'm about to prepare for my lab at three. The lighting in here is not good and I hate it, I'm sorry, but we're gonna work with what we've got. Um, I just said I was getting ready for my lab. So like, I was supposed to have this lab last week um, it snowed and it got canceled. So she wanted to reschedule for this Thursday, but I get my second round of the Moderna vaccine. So I, I like, I cannot reschedule that cause I already rescheduled it cause it was supposed to be last Thursday. So like basically the two events that I had flip flopped and it, it really caused a mess for me, but 
instead of doing my lab Thursday, like I am originally supposed to, she is being so, so kind and letting me do it today. I'm not supposed to have another class. I'm supposed to be done after my genetics class. And then I get the rest of the day usually just to hang out and do whatever. That's not the case today. So this lab goes from three to five and then at six, which by the way, I have to be at the rec 30 minutes before. So at 5.30, I need to be at the rec ready to teach spin. Very eventful next few hours pretty much of my day, um, but it's all right. You know, we're getting the lab practical out of the way. Rant over. <music> and it's pouring the snow again outside so I know the sidewalks are probably gonna be a little slick so I want to take my time and I just want to get there where this isn't really my assigned lab I want to like make sure like I know what station I need to be at um, if I have to share with someone then who am I sharing with I just kind of want to get there early and like remind my professor hey you know you said I can be here so I'm here but yeah, I'm hoping too that I can get done with my experiment early. I know we have a quiz and then from the quiz we move on to the lab practical, which is like the experiment portion. If you don't have like a chem lab, this is just me explaining. If you do have a chem lab, then I'm just rambling and I'm sorry, but I'm hoping I can get done kind of early so I can come back and eat something and just change and not be in such a rush before spin. <music> Hello guys, I'm sorry the lighting is so bad in here. Um, it's really dark outside from the snow, but I just got out of my lab. Um, if you follow me on my Instagram, you'll see that I posted a picture of my solution that I made and like kind of the effects of it. Um, so it was actually a really cool experiment. I got it to work, so it's a win. I don't know how the quiz went. I kind of got flustered working on my equations like I usually do because I second guess myself. So fingers crossed we done okay on that. Um, I got out early so that's a good thing. So now I'm going to eat just something small. Kind of have like a first dinner and then after spin I'll eat my actual dinner um, and get changed and head to the rec center to prepare for my spin class. First class of the semester. Pretty excited. I have a full class signed up, so fingers crossed everybody comes and it's just a good time. I'm on my way to spin. Um, obviously, I'm leaving early because I am a good employee. But no, all seriousness, uh, we have to get there early to greet people. And then whenever people come in, we need them to remind them uh, you have to wear your mask the whole time. If that's a problem and you feel like you can't do that, then you can't be in the class. So... I gotta go give my disclaimers to my spin class, um, which is always fun, but usually everyone um, is really great about following the rules and doing what they are supposed to. And I need to go make sure the music works, that the box are okay, so there's just a lot to it, but I'm really excited because like I said earlier, it's the first spin class of the semester and of the year. <laughs> that was kind of cheesy, but... I'm really excited because it's a full class and I just hope everyone has a good time. My closet door is open and it's been open all day and that's kind of bothering me but I have stuff sitting in front of it so that's why it's open. I can't shut it. 
disclaimer, I guess. But obviously I'm back from teaching spin. It was a really, really good spin class. Um, I was even allowed to add two extra people because um, I knew them and they really wanted to spin. So, and I asked my boss and he was like, sure, go ahead. As long as everyone's wearing a mask and everybody did wear a mask. And let me tell you, doing cardio in a mask is something else. But right now I have a homework assignment due at midnight for chemistry. I'm like out of breath because I just carried a bunch of stuff upstairs. But I'm about to do a homework assignment for chemistry right now and then I'll probably will take a shower and Cash and I uh, talked about watching Captain Marvel. We started WandaVision on Disney Plus and he's seen all of, like the Avengers Marvel like that series. I haven't so we're like re-watching all the movies and I just finished Captain America the first Avenger and let me tell you I was missing out. Those are really good movies. And if you haven't watched them, you should. And if you have, comment down below what your favorite Marvel movie is. But I'm rambling because I'm kind of procrastinating this assignment. So I'm just going to stop and get on into 